Hey guys! I'm back with another video and today I wanted to show you my morning routine. So I go to work during the week and I wanted to show you what it looks like when I get ready on a typical morning. So enjoy! <laughs> So mornings are really hard for me. I am a really deep sleeper and I can never wake up with just one alarm. So as you can see, I've set so many alarms and I like, it takes me probably an hour, I think, to wake up in the morning, but eventually I do get up and then I'll start by going downstairs and having breakfast. Um, and after I've had breakfast, I come up and I start my beautifying routine in the morning. I'll get my um, facial cleansing stuff and I use the special cleansing gel by Dermalogica and my Clairsonic Mia 2. Add a bit of cleanser all over the face. Focusing on the nose because that's my problem area. So it takes me about a minute to wash my face. And this gets all the dirt and all dead skin cells that I have and then I do a base and this is called the vitamin enrich face base and it's by Bobby Brown and this has cream in it and it's got um, prep stuff as well so it's good um, to wear just as a general cream but also as a makeup base because I'll be doing my makeup after this and it makes the skin nice and smooth and even and it's moisturizing but not sticky so first thing I'll use is the Quarterly Vino Perfect, and this is a perfecting day fluid. Um, and it's got SPF 15, and it's good for all skin types. Um, so I just use this kind of in my problem areas mostly, around my nose, and towards the sides of my nose on my cheeks. And this helps just to blur any imperfections, and it acts as another good makeup base as well for your makeup, which is good. So then next I'll put on my favourite foundation at the moment and that is the Hello Flawless Oxygen Glow Foundation. This is my benefit. And I'll pump a little bit of this onto my hand first. Then I dip my brush in. And again I focus this mainly towards my nose and cheeks. Which is where I get the most red and the most blemishes. So the next thing I'll use is my Ben Nye Banana Powder and this is one of my favourite setting powders. I just pop a little bit into the lid and I use a big brush and I put the powder pretty much everywhere except the tops of my cheeks. The foundation that I use is quite glowy so it gives a nice shine to the cheek and I want to leave that there but I don't want my nose or my um, chin or forehead to be shiny really so I just mattify those. The next thing I'll use is bronzer and I have a lot of favourites. I'm just using the Burberry one today in Copper Glow number 2. And I'll take my tapered brush and bring this into the hollows of my cheeks and a little bit up towards the upper part. And you bring it around the top of my forehead as well. This is why I like wearing the headband because it keeps all my hair off my face and it makes it a lot easier to do my makeup and my skincare. So next thing I'll do is my brows and I use a MAC brow powder. By the way, all of the products that I'm using and all the brushes and everything will be in the description in case you're interested in what I'm using. But I just fill that in. I spend a lot of my time on my brows actually. I spend the most time on my brows and anything else. Then I'll just brush them into place. Just so they look a little bit more natural and neat. And I don't really do much to my eyes on a weekday kind of basis. So I'll just add a little bit of a shimmery colour to my inner corner. And I bring that onto the inner third of my eye as well. Then I take a little bit of shadow insurance or primer for my eyelids. Even though I'm not really wearing any eyeshadows um, 
on the actual eyelid. I don't like my eyeliner, eyes, eyelids to get oily. Then I just do a little bit of eyeliner and then um, just using a felt tip liner for this. I don't do anything crazy during the week. I like to keep it pretty close to my lash line. You could flick it out if you wanted to. I like to do that on Friday. Then I just curl my eyelashes, because my eyelashes are very flat and pathetic. And just a little bit of mascara. I try to keep it very simple because I always get up late and sleep through my alarms, so I have very little time do my makeup in the morning and then just for a little bit of color on my lips and to keep it natural and lasting throughout the day I use a little bit of a um, cheek and lip tint this is the burnt tint one and that's it so that was a really simple and easy makeup look to do and it literally took me under 10 minutes and as for my hair I usually keep it pretty simple either in a ponytail or a bun but I like to change it up a little bit and do some cute hairstyles sometimes. So if you'd like to see a video on uh, quick and easy hairstyles to do before work or school, let me know and I'd be happy to do that. So that's pretty much it for my makeup. After that, I'll just get dressed and I actually have a video where I show my work week in outfits. So if you want to have a look at that, I'll link it here or somewhere in the description. And then I'm ready to go. So that's it. Please leave in the comments down below how many alarms does it take you to wake up in the morning. Like and favorite this video if you did like it. And I'll see you next time. Bye.